Yeah, happy with the win, obviously. Uh, I think with the ball, we did well to keep taking wickets throughout. Probably towards the end there, our discipline wasn't too great, and we let them get probably 10 or 15 too much, but we knew chasing 160, the wicket was a bit better than it looked yesterday. So 160, if we get one or two partnerships, uh, yeah, we'd, it, we'd be in a good position. If we lost two early wickets, which wasn't ideal, so we had to rebuild from there. But as soon as we got that first partnership, we, we were in a good position. Yeah, I think about, like it played today, maybe 160, 170, so they were a bit short maybe. Um, but yeah, in saying that, I, f I feel like it's still a wicket that if you bowl well and you execute your plans, you, you can obviously still be effective like Bjorn showed today uh, and like KG showed today. It's just about managing that short boundary and changing your plans uh, to so, so, so keep guys away from hitting towards that, which obviously puts the bowlers under pressure. Yeah, it's a, sp a special feeling to be part of a team with, with as many stars, but I think the thing that we spoke about is not leaving it up to the next big name. You know, if it's your day, take it through. And that's why I'm a bit disappointed today that I went out and take it through. But, you know, there's, there's so many match winners in that team. So plan is, yeah, if one or two can, of those can come off like today, myself and KG, you know, tomorrow it'll probably be someone else. Um, and that's a luxury of having so many stars in your team. Yeah, I think as a batter on these slower wickets, as soon as you give yourself a chance, you, you, you're you giving yourself the best chance to succeed, not, not necessarily go t too hard too early, uh, which the Warriors probably did. And as soon as you get the pace of the wickets, give yourself 15, 20 balls, you can you can start targeting guys and and uh, yeah, that's what I looked at.